All right, coding fans, here we are on incrementing the value. Some of these are getting a little bit technical, uh, and you need a little bit of exclam exclamation to go along with uh, the coding. So we have three sides here, uh, and we need to collect gems. Um, and we're going to start off with our gem counter being a value of zero. Uh, and if I run my code here, uh, you'll see that they randomly pop up, okay? Okay. Uh, and I'll run my code a couple of times just to see what's going on. Um, and we're going to notice that this is going to, because they randomly pop up, um, we're going to need our character to check all of them. There are three sides. I see this as a, a for loop. You could use a while loop as well. Uh, but this looks like, and we'll use both. Uh, but I see this, all right, this is a for loop. There are three sides, so we're going to collect gems on all three of our sides. Um, and I want them to move to the very end. So to get them to move to the very end, I'm going to say while not is blocked. So while our character is not blocked, we're going to get our character to move forward. Um, and that gets him moving forward, and he'll check every time, am I blocked, am I blocked, am I blocked? Okay, we also need him to check, okay, if he's on a gym. So we're gonna use our if statement. So if is on gym, we need to collect the gym. And then also we need to count it. So we're gonna get our gym counter and we need to increment it, we need to add to it. There are two ways to do this. You could say gym counter plus gym counter equals gym counter plus one. But I like this plus equals button right there. Uh, what that means is add to what we already had. Okay, so if you've got zero, that means add one to zero. If you have three, that means add one to three. So you'd have four. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to add one to however many we have as we collect them. All right, so that will get him to move forward and collect while he's blocked. That is our code for while is blocked. We want to go outside of this. I'm going to clean this up a little bit. Um, and you'll notice that as I move around here, it will highlight um, the if statement, the end of the if statement, and the whole if statement. So it'll tell you what you're inside. Um, I want to get outside of this while loop, but stay inside of the, um, stay inside of our for loop. And at the end of our while loop, I'm going to put, is so while it's not blocked move forward and collect the gems and then at the very end he's going to turn right okay and this should be our simple code so i like to start off by running it regular and then speeding it up faster there we go we collect and count each gem at the very end we turn right nothing to collect there this is the third time he's going he's collected everything and there we go Super simple, nice, easy code. We have a for loop, we have a while loop, we have an if statement. Uh, this is great code.